Former Ankeny volleyball standouts Jaylee Winters and Megan Ballinger returned to their hometown on Sunday as the Creighton volleyball team battled Wisconsin in its final scrimmage of the spring season. The exhibition match was played at Ankeny Centennial High School, where Winters led the Jaguars to a state title in 2014. It was so much fun. I've been looking forward to this all week, so to finally be back here and see how many people turned out, um, it was a lot of fun. Ballinger started at Ankeny High School before joining winners at Creighton. She also enjoyed Sunday's trip back to Central Iowa. It was a lot of fun just to kind of be back here and even like driving in was fun just to like see Ankeny and um, just excited to come back home. A large crowd came out on a sunny afternoon to watch two of the strongest volleyball programs in Division I. Yeah, I mean, we were hoping for a good turnout, but I honestly didn't expect there to be that many people there. So thank you so much to everybody who came. Ballinger, shown here pounding a kill during the first set, said she wasn't surprised by the large turnout. I think that just uh, speaks to the volleyball fans and the Ankeny fans um, around the area. It was awesome. Creighton went on to win the match in four sets. Winners closed out the Badgers with a kill from the left side. It was really, really nice to get a win just going out of spring season because now we won't play an actual match until August. Um, so yeah, we're just excited and um, ready to see like what we look like in August. The upcoming season will be the final one for winners, who is expected to graduate in December. After previously considering playing beach volleyball, she has now decided to turn pro and will head overseas in 2019. I just can't think of a better time than now to just go overseas. Um, I'm young, I'm not tied down to anything, so might as well just go now, make some money. And one big part that came into it was that I can always come back when I'm done playing overseas and get my master's degree as a grad assistant or an assistant coach somewhere.